Manchester police are issuing a serious warning about a product known as spice. Yeah, this product is sold as a potpourri, but police say many people are smoking it. And there has been an alarming number of overdoses in the Queen City this week. They say the overdoses seem to be associated with a particular brand called Smacked. Ray Brewer joins us live now in Victory Park in Manchester, where one of those overdose victims was found. And Ray, how are city leaders planning to tackle this growing problem? Well, Sean, right now it's not illegal to possess or sell spice in the city of Manchester, but city officials want to change that. So they'll be meeting later today to try and find ways to make this product illegal. What's being called a public safety hazard is being sold in brightly colored wrapping with cartoon like character and both flavors like bubblegum, blueberry, and lemon lime. Police say therein lies the problem. It can be marketed as being legal. So more, more people, maybe children, more children are apt to use it. That's why I think it's, uh, it's more dangerous. The product is called Smacked, a brand of spice that's sold at area convenience stores as potpourri. But police say people are using it to get high. Treated with a synthetic chemical compound similar to THC, Smacked has effects similar to marijuana. They're out of it. They're just totally out of it. They just like walk around like they're looking into space and looking behind them and like their eyes look different. They're not sound weird or not, but they don't look like us. They look weird. Within 24 hours this week, Manchester Emergency Services took two dozen people to the hospital for overdosing on the hallucinogenic prompting city officials to issue public safety warnings. Police have removed the product from area stores and they're urging parents to keep a watchful eye. Let's find a way first to get it off the street. And off the street means getting it out of the stores. And if we can find the pressure point there, then I think the rest will follow suit. Now, police believe that batch of uh, spice, which all those people overdosed on, could have been a bad batch. And while you have to be 18 to buy spice, still, police are urging parents to talk to their kids about the product. Reporting live in Manchester, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.